Well, we had 10 teams at the, at the course, uh, five from the SSC, that included us as well. So it was, it was a great event for us, anyway, for Florida Tech. The Leah, uh, who, like, like we said before, was our top woman uh, two years ago and one of the top in the conference, if not the region. She had a great race uh, on, uh, on Saturday. Coming in third, uh, Pauline and, and Jenny Lucas uh, both had very good races. Uh, we asked them to go out together and stay together as much as they could, and they, and they did. Sky, who's a freshman, um, was about 30 seconds off her PR of all times. Uh, and again, they're all working hard. Uh, on the men's side, um, I thought the race went fairly well. We, we planned to go out, uh, other than Malta, to go out as a group. So we got them through the first two laps, and then we let Joe go. It, with that said, Malta won the race, um, which is very promising. He's in very good shape. Uh, Joe Berg is another, our senior and captain. He is in very good shape too. Uh, Malta's performance was, was excellent in, in, in the sense that he, he went out after the race. He, he, he stayed with the lead group the whole time until he felt it was necessary to break away a little bit. And uh, with that said, he, he was the SSC runner of the week. Congrats to him, uh, and he's only going to get better as we go along through the season. we got another race coming up uh, for the men and the women uh, on the 14th, which is this Saturday at UF. Um, we felt very positive with, with everybody's performance in the game. Um, we thought the leadership was good. We, we felt good about the level of fitness that we had. The first goal, Sol scored, was well worked. He got across the field well. and. Sol's athletic and was able to get in behind their back four and you know got a little bit of uh, luck with a ricochet but, but finished his goal well. thought the second goal was one of the, you know, was a very good goal for us. A lot, a lot of players involved, I think seven players were involved in the, in the build up and a, and a really good finish from Hugo. Auburn well, Montgomery we know is going to be a, a challenging game. Um, the second game we play Limestone, I think they started the year ranked 25th in the country, um, always a very strong team. Um, we play that game at 12 on Sunday. So two good games to look forward to. We're very excited to, to be in this position. Um, again, it's, it's gonna be a good regional weekend for us, so we're looking forward to it.